Now they bring him from the weak side, hit him perfectly strong side. Curtis Athletic almost gets the steal. And Walston finds Spalding in transition. Back and forth we go, 8-4, the early lead for Ellsworth. Three minutes gone in the first quarter. McDonald from the corner. Well, that time, Francis made the adjustment, got his hands in the passing lane. Yeah, went to the well one too many times there. Good adjustment defensively. One ten remaining in this first quarter. It's 18 to 10. Ellsworth. Francis can't get them out. Under a minute to go. We'll see what the Eagles do here. Mercier has been waiting to check in for the past couple minutes. <laughs> what do you like it? Kids getting up and down the floor. Yeah. Not a lot of fouls called. Not a lot of need for fouls all day. Right now for Orno, trailing by 12 early in the second quarter. Trying to get things going offensively here. Francis. With a face-up triple, it was too heavy, and now Curtis in transition. Bragdon, corner pocket, got it. Post-entry feed, they get it to Will Francis. Swings it. All blocked by Hardy was Ben Francis, and he saves it right to Curtis, lobs it up to Palmer, right back to Brody Mercier, now to Miles Palmer, and he'll float it up and in. Did they all touch it? And right here, this has been their bread and butter. Miles Palmer for three. Well, it just makes you that much tougher to guard. I think it's a credit to Coach Peter Austin, who's built a terrific program in Ellsworth. Curtis double clutches, 